even though the sun's not out, it's raining. It's a scorcher out here in South Mississippi. So right now, Cam's going to put her out of target at 100 yards. Look, let's take a look. And I got a little surprise for her. She wants to do some deer hunting this year. And she only has an AR-15. So I'm going to let her shoot a 762 by 39 See if she can swing that. If she can handle that, I might go sneak and buy her a brand new 308. But don't tell her. Let's see what happens in a little bit. She's on her way back. See y'all in a second. Back in the pew pew safe, it uh, I've never seen it. It's never been out of the gun. I've never shot it. So um, let's reveal it. Oh, it's tied at the top. Oh, I think we'll beat up. Get your eyes and ears on so you can see if you can hit that jug at 100, 100 yards. Alright, All right, so now that I have my eyes and ears on, um, let's put some bullets down the range. You got them sights? You ready? Mm -hmm. Just let me know. I'm hitting it, but it's not that bad to shoot. We'll go check in a minute. You're not used to not having a scope. So how was your first time shooting something with a little tiny, tiny bit of power? I think I handled it really well. It wasn't that bad to shoot it. It was really loud though, even with the earmuffs on. But Did you hit it? A hundred yards at a one gallon bucket. I hit it twice. So I hit it up here near the, like the handle and then I hit it down here. And uh, I think it's, I think I did really good because if you can see it's still in the same line. So I think that's a good way to shoot. And out of how many bullets? Four? I think that's good for my first time shooting that kind of gun. Now, for it being my first time uh, shooting that bullet slinger, I thought I did pretty good. So, yeah. 
If y'all want to see me do anything else, comment down below. Like, subscribe, and turn on that notification bell so that way you get notified every time that we post a new video. And we'll see y'all in the next one. Peace!